closing in here ahead of game three. And we'll be back in a minute to get it started. From the city of brotherly love and Citizens Bank Park, MLB The Show brings you the National League Championship Series. The Atlanta Braves taking on the Philadelphia Phillies. John Chambi alongside Chris Singleton. A lot going on in this series as we get ready for game three, Singy. And Boog, this is as close to an elimination game as you can get without it actually being one. Going down 3-0 would more or less just end this thing. So this game's going to tell us whether we're going to have a real series in store for us or if we're just going to be packing our bags and going home. A lot of people feel these teams are more evenly matched. The first two games would indicate. So we'll see if we get a bounce back performance in this one. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. And here is King Tejada. Singh, you talk about a guy that has all the skills. The range is really good, but the arm just stands out, and he makes all the plays. In the air, left field. Lee makes the grab for the second out. That is good. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And here's the veteran outfielder, Bryce Harper. Harper. Nakamura back to work. On the ground, out to short. And quickly one away in the second. Batting fifth, the center fielder, Justin. And digging in for Philadelphia, Jose Castaneda. Fell off to a great start. He's really cruising out there on the mound. He's got a chance to get through these first two innings with under 20 pitches. Go, that could set him up to go deep into this game. Hit hard on the ground to short. Throws to first. And that is the third out of the inning. One left for Philadelphia. They trail it here 2-0. Now the Atlanta cleanup hitter, King Tejada. He consistently hits the ball hard. His exit velocity and barrel rate near the tops in the league. And nice and patient. Get your pitch. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Tejada batting in the cleanup spot. And he's a former Gold Glove Award winner. Acuna, the runner at first with two gone. To the right side. Can't glove it cleanly. Now that designated hitter, Yorbit Vivas. So now the DH spot, Yorbit Vivas. Grounded out his first time. Left-hand hitter waits. Ripped into right field, base hit. Now a long throw home. It's off the mark, and he scores. And it's 4-0. That's now three hits in a row for the offense. Didn't get cheated on that swing and squared it up perfectly. Came off the bat at 111, and when that's the case, the odds are very much in your favor as a hitter. Rondell Davis next up for the Braves. 0 for 1 so far. Pitch is in there. 1 and 2. And downstairs. Recognize that changeup right out of the hand. Just spit on it. And down on strikes he goes. 
That ends the inning and stops things from getting out of hand. So it's two runs on four hits, no errors, and a couple left on. We head now to the home half of inning number three. It's the Braves four and the Phillies nothing. Ready to go, bottom four. And now for the, for the Phillies, Bryce Harper. Right right. Certainly you'd say Bryce Harper's Harper. signature moment, game five of the National League Championship Series in 2022. That opposite field home run that put the Phillies ahead and would send them to the World Series off the Padres' Robert Suarez. One out in the bottom of the fourth. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air, lets the defense work behind him. So two down. Here's a speed threat. Edmundo Sosa. He's 0 for 1. On the ground. Tejada. Now the throw to first on the run. That's the third out. Inning over. Pure athleticism on that one. In the air, legs split a bit, and fires across the diamond. He's going to get a lot of high fives in the dugout. We're back, and they make a change to start the sixth. The new pitcher, Griff McGarry. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. Now pitching for the Phillies. Number 61. Stepping in the long ball threat, King Tejada. One for two. This kid is so special. He's a shortstop by trade and big time power. And here it comes. Up the middle, on the run, throw to first. Leadoff man retired in the sixth. Here's Harper now. The right fielder, number three. Ryan. The 2-2 two -two on the way. Harper. Swing and a ground ball out to short. One away, bottom of the sixth. Now batting, the center fielder, Justin. So first and second with two outs. And now here is King Tejada, one for three. You talk about the power and the speed together. Oh, we knew he was going to be a stud just coming up, making his way through the minor leagues, and quickly at this level, an impact player. Hard hit, but right at him and left. And now it's Atlanta's cleanup hitter, King Tejada. Outfield deep here, trying to prevent anything over their heads. Singing, you can't ask for anything more. This guy checks all the boxes offensively. He is the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game time. It starts in the afternoon the way he prepares and gets ready for the ball game. I tell you what, his teammates feed off of the leadership that he shows on and off the field. Can't glove it cleanly. I think he got a little casual on that play and took it for granted a little bit. So maybe just as much of a mental mistake as a physical one. And with two outs, that's a tough one to swallow for the entire defense. Here's the pitch. Runner on the goal. Ball misses. Throw to second. Great jump. Well, in the postseason, I'd say we see more teams playing for one run, trying to apply some pressure. And that's exactly the case right here. Speed on the bases, put him in motion, and it worked out. Now time to execute in the batter's box. Pitch, huh? The 3-1. And a swing and a miss. Some bullpen action for Philadelphia. Jaime Berea preparing to come on if needed. Yeah, come on now, big guy. 3-2 now. Fouls that off to the left and will do it again. Two outs and one in scoring position. And that one is lifted in the air. Harper has a beat on it. Makes the catch inning over. So in the end, ten men come to the plate. Six of them come around to score. Last half of the eighth coming up. It's the Braves 12 and the Phillies 1. 
bottom of the inning, and now it's Alec Bohm. He's kind of an outlier, especially when guys are consciously sacrificing contact to deliver power. Ground ball up the middle. Fires to first on the run. One up, one down. Now batting the third baseman, Ed Mundo. These guys have been truly dominant in the series. Up now, three games to none. Pretty demoralizing on the other side. You want to get this thing over as quickly as possible. So stay focused, come back for the next game, and close out this series. So Singy, as the numbers show, a great performance on the mound in this one. Absolutely, and that really set the tone from the beginning. A fantastic effort. 14-1 is how it ends. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon.